Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're making Italian stuffed artichokes. Have you ever tried them? Once you try them out, I bet this will be your favorite way to eat artichokes. So let's get started. Firstly, I prepare the filling for the artichokes. Super easy. I simply mix together breadcrumbs, some fresh garlic, grated cheese, the original recipe calls for parmesan cheese, but if you're vegetarian and you don't eat parmesan since it contains rennet, you can use another type of cheese or a vegetarian friendly parmesan. I used mostly parmesan and also a little bit of mozzarella cheese. I added half a teaspoon of salt, black pepper, and finally some fresh parsley. And the filling is ready. So now I wash the artichokes and the water will also help separating the leaves from the core. I cut the stems so that the artichokes can stand on their own, but please don't throw them away. Just cut away the bottom part and cook them with the artichokes and they're super delicious. So now I stuff the artichokes and each leaf drop a nice pinch of the filling. But don't overfill them because otherwise the stuffing will remain dry and not get cooked well. So I go from the outside of the artichokes and fill all around until it gets really hard to separate the leaves. Then I'll stop. I repeat the same process for all the artichokes and then I place them in a big pot with about two fingers of water. The water basically needs to cover the base of the artichokes and arrive just below the attachment of the leaves. Slightly salt the water and don't forget to throw in the stems too. And lastly, we're going to pour a fine little drizzle of olive oil all around the leaves. This will help the filling cook well, so I don't suggest skipping this step. Then I cover the pot with a lid and I let it cook for about 45-50 minutes at medium heat without opening the lid so that the steam kept inside of the pot cooks the artichoke leaves very well. Also keep an eye on the pot to see if you need to add more water as it evaporates. I didn't need to. So the thing about cooking artichokes is that the cooking time may vary between like 30 minutes to 50 minutes or sometimes even more depending on the size of the artichokes or even the quality and the kind of artichokes you picked. So I suggest after 30 minutes of cooking to take one of the leaf and test it to see if it's soft enough to be eaten. You can also cook them on a pressure cooker and half the cooking time. To be honest, I usually go with the pressure cooker because it's way faster. Once they're ready, you'll notice that the artichokes tend to open up a bit, just like blooming flowers, and you're ready to enjoy them. If you're not familiar on how to eat them, you'll just eat a leaf at a time. You'll peel the first leaf and you scrape off the stuffing and the leaf meat with your teeth. Let me just show you. So good. And if it's cooked right, the meaty part of the leaf, it will just come right out with no effort. So you don't actually eat the whole leaf, but just its substance. So once you've finished all the bigger leaves, there are the last tender leaves that you can pull off like this and eat the bottom part. Now we arrive to the core and you'll need to take out this kind of hairy part of it and then you can eat it and enjoy. Also, have you ever tried drinking a glass of water right after eating an artichoke? It's gonna taste sweet. Try it if you haven't. <laughs> mm. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for new weekly recipes. Bye bye.